The trace error feature is helpful when you're just tracing for one error, but if you have a lot of data on your worksheet, then you're going to want to use the error checking feature. So the first thing I want you to do is to check this page for errors. We're going to go to the formula bar, formula auditing group, and we're going to click on error checking, and then we're going to choose error checking again. And the question is, which cell has the error? And right here it tells you there's an error in cell N12. So you want to put that answer right here. And then I'd like for you to correct that error. Currently it tells me that the error is that it's being divided by 0. So we can edit the formula. And if you notice, when I click Edit Formula, it's trying to average what's in these cells right here. And there's nothing in these cells. So we need to get the proper data in these cells. So over here... It's asking us what the total is for each of these rows. So to get the total, I'm just going to click on the Sum button and hit Enter. Then I'm going to grab my Fill handle, which is the square in the corner, and drag down. When you get these hashtags, that just means there wasn't enough room, so I'm going to expand that column. And now my error has disappeared.